Why do you think we did this? To mm -hmm. give the feeling of you forever it went down. Mm -hmm. How they felt. And most of the time they did it. Right? Okay. And, and they depend on each other. They depend on each other and support. Support and got it. Yes. Everything that you say is correct. But let's look at it in this perception, in this different angle. You see, when I increased my pace mm -hmm. and you could not cope with it, you were at liberty and you took your hand off. Because you have a chance to take your hand off. Have you thought about our ancestors? They were in chains. So even if you, could, you couldn't cope with it, you have to force yourself to cope with it. And even if you can no more, they just fall and they drag you on the feet. People have to escape at the expense of the other. Our ancestors were only fighting for one thing. They were fighting for the chains and shackles to be off their feet and hands. They fought it in here, they fought it on the Atlantic Ocean, and they fought it in the Caribbean and in, 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 in America before they had their chains off. When they took their chains off, they brought their chains to us and they told us, I've taken the chains off and you are my children. This is the chain I've given it to you. Do whatever you want to do with the chain. They gave the chain back to us. When they gave the chain back to us, did you know what we used the chain for? We just open our mind, open our brains and chain our brains. Mm -hmm. That is why Bob Valley said we should emancipate ourselves from mental slavery. We change, we put the chain in here, and that made the spirit that was in us all to go. Because the spirit fought for us, gave us the keys for our freedom. And we also settled it in here. Why am I saying that? Why am I saying that? If I Mom, I'm your son, and I offend you. Will you kill me? No. no. You talk to me. You make sure you talk to me to correct me. You tell me this, that, this, and this that you did. Never do it anymore, because it's nothing that you have to do. Because we are the same people. The accounts have a proverb. They say, say, I call out John and I. I don't want to even tell you the meaning of this program. I'll let my able brother tell you the meaning of this program. Oh, <laughs> yes. Meaning that if you have a baby and the baby defecates on your ties, foot, hand, because it's a baby, it's good for you to clean it than to chop it off. Mm -hmm. I've never seen a mother or a father that your child defecates on your tie as well as on you and then you take a knife and cut your tie off yeah. you definitely have to clean it mm -hmm. so, so, that's the so which means whenever I offend you like, we should talk about our own yeah. and don't allow other people to tell us what we need to do mm -hmm. because mm -hmm. I told you about their using of more of the verbal words mm -hmm. for them they tell us they come to you and they tell you, these people sold us, these people sold us. In this world, that leaves all spirits conceivables, good and bad in the society. But we were having so much of the good ones than the bad ones. But even if we have offended ourselves, we need to come together, reconcile, bridge that gap. Because one thing that they are preaching, which we are always listen to them, is only one thing. They are scared of unity. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. So, they are just in there somewhere maddening the waters because they don't want us to come together. Because just imagine, even only you, they can't conquer you. So imagine if we all come together as one. Mm -hmm. And that is what they are scared of. Mm -hmm. This area that we're standing in now played the most role in the slave market. This was, this was where uh, the first auction and the first branding took place. 
Now, it's a very, it's a very big area. So the raiders were chained around the bamboo trees and the others is a very big area. So when the time comes for the auctioning, they bring them closer in here because there was a river for their auction to, 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 to take through. Now, when you look, bruh, Now, when you look here, there was a big baba tree which was right here. It was uprooted in 1994 by a strong wind. The baba tree is so tired because we, it has supported a whole lot of us. The baba tree was where we were at our first auction. So after making us look attractive, they bring us in here, chain us around it, for our first auction. Our brothers were bought with things like used clothes, tobacco, guns, and I was even reading a book which made this revelation that during that era, even animals were valuable as compared to us. And I always ask myself, is this, same, is this still the same or it has changed? <laughs> In the US of A, wherever you're coming from, you have all these laws that have been enacted to support the rights of animal. Animal yeah. rights, yeah. animal. You can't even kick your own animal. Yeah. The, same, the same protection that they, they give to those people, do we get the same protection as well? No. But we don't come here to be bitter. I told you earlier, we come here to be better. Because when you become better, it is very difficult for people to defeat you. I'll be taking you, after selling them, we take them to the burning section. This is where they put the metal in fire. Stab it at your back. Your chest. Or your shoulder. As an identification. Because the trade were having so many intermediaries, sometimes captives pass through the hands of a lot, many owners. Mm -hmm. And when you pass through the hands of many owners, all the previous marks on you, need to be cleaned with, through the same process and the same process will be used to put another mark on you. So imagine passing through the hands of 10, then I'm sure all your body will be, will be branded in all ways. Then what's in here, they match you again. You've never, you've never even recovered from your pains, but they still continue the journey with you again, which was 35 miles to the Cape Coast Dungeons where the slave ship was being docked. We go to the river. So let's come closer to uh, the river. Now this Now this river we see here is a very very big river. Most often at times it overflows, it banks and you can't even get closer. They are two separate rivers, they are not the same river. When you observe carefully from the river, you realize this part of the river is flowing and this part of the river is slipping. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. The one that is flowing, whenever the river is up, the force here is so much that you can't even swim this side. But this side is always slipping. And I don't know why it is always slipping. This river is called Amma Emisa. Amma because she is a Saturday goddess. It's getting its source from the Pra River. The river that we were dumped in to die, that is when this one is getting its source from. Mm. This river flows through towns, villages, 
communities and end up at the sea at Cape Coast. This one here is called Nonko Isio. Nonko means river. Nonko means slave. And Isio means river. The slave river. They were made to get themselves in this, but not in that. Because of the waves, with this, because it's karma, they can control them. But with this, some might escape because most of our occupation were farming, fishing, and other things, so we know how to swim. Mm -hmm. So, imagine you in chains and shackles push down there while, while the river is up, like this. Push down in there to wash yourself. You drown. A lot of our brothers and sisters drown in this river. Most of them were also seen as rebels, which are called them freedom fighters. They were also killed. The journey from Salaga to Asin Manso was very tough on them. Most of them landed here in a deplorable state and they were also killed. So together, all those that lost their lives in here were buried right there. So all these ones that you are seeing are graveyards of mm -hmm. our ancestors. I recall the place, the Bamboo Cemetery. Mm -hmm. In 2004, there was a UNESCO project. They came to excavate this part of the land. To make a way with some material evidences to back the fact that indeed it happened. Mm -hmm. But the chiefs became annoyed. Because why do you have to excavate the land of our ancestors? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Because the chiefs always push to this assertion that our ancestors should have a peaceful rest. Mm -hmm. So from that day onwards, an embargo was placed on this land that no other person or anybody should excavate the site. Mm -hmm. You realize this community, when you were coming in here, you realize this is a little different from most tourist sites that you visit. Mm -hmm. Because with the most tourist sites, you have people selling uh, mm -hmm. paraphernalia all mm -hmm. around. Mm -hmm. But you realize when you came here, nobody was selling anything. Mm -hmm. That is how seriousness uh, the chiefs attached to this community, this facility. Because this is their ritual setting. This is the strength of their community. Mm -hmm. And they can even forgo all riches just to maintain the site. And I'll show you, I'll give you a proof why they forget riches just to maintain the site. Mm -hmm. Now, washing them in the river, that is where they use the bamboo leaves and the bamboo trees. Mm. The smallest part of the tree, they just cut it, split it open to look like a brush. Mm. And they use it to scrub them while they are in the mm. river. Mm. After scrubbing them, you realize almost all of them have mm. mm. cuts. Mm. That is the part of the journey that our color changes from this color to red. Mm. You can see all the blood. Mm. And after that, they drag them from the river to where we are now. Make them go through another vigorous exercises in addition. After which, their blood is clean and they are smeared with palm oil and shea water mm -hmm. to, to shine before the auction and the branding. I always say, all this that I'm saying to you now doesn't come closer to what our ancestors endure. All my facial expression and everything doesn't come closer to what they endure. If this land could speak, <laughs> if these rivers could speak, even if these trees could speak, I'm sure we'll tell them, please say no more because we cannot listen. Somebody asked me, Kofi, why is it that the two of that does not meet? Then I was like, I'm a tour guide. I'm not a specialist. How do you expect me to do this? <laughs> but later I had another answer to it, which I'm sure is the best answer. The number of blood that was flowed in this river, the number of blood that was flowed in this river, they've seen so many things that 
they don't even want to I don't even want to bring mine and share with you. I just want to keep it to myself. Mm. Because in sharing it, I can't. So let me just keep it to myself and just, and just sleep somewhere. Mm. So both of them are keeping their own to themselves. Mm. But when they bring it out to say it to us, we cannot stand it. How many are we? One, two, three. Do we have uh, some couples and are in in here? Yes. Well, please, can I see the couples? Okay, so you get one for yourself. Another? Okay, you get one for yourself. Another? It's three of us. Three. Me and my two grandkids. Okay. Take it. You take it for mom. Okay. So uh, everyone is going to get one of the coin. You have it already. Yeah. One. 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 You have a coin. Yes. Thank you. Okay. 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 Sorry. One. I'm not going to give you one. <laughs> one. No, I will make a promise. Yeah, if you have a coin, you want to If you if you also have any foreign coin, we can share. Yeah, you can share. share. Who needs yes. one? Yes. Yeah. Last. Yeah. Oh, okay. 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 So. So we be going. We should have gone to the slave river before we go to Ama Emisa. Uh, so we, we don't have much time as well because we'll be going to Kumasi, uh, which the traffic is very, very. So if you don't mind and we all agree together, let's just do the rituals in this and we go back. Only if you agree. If not, mm -hmm. I don't have a problem. We do whatever you want us to do. So, so uh, I guess uh, sometimes when you are in your ancestors' hood, there's nothing that should stop you from doing what you want to do. So even if the time is not right, we don't care. You have to do it. So we're going to the river, but please don't use, don't pass through this act. When you're going, we have to use this side. The reason being that look at the words on it. Yeah. Is that yeah. your last one? Yeah. No. So we don't use it. <coughs> so we pass behind it to the river. When you get to the river, uh, the, this river is where we don't spend much time in there. You just take some and just wash your, wash your hands with it and just move to the next river. Okay. That's all. So please, how do we say let's go? The men should support the ladies so that we don't fall. Careful. Wash my hands. Yes. Uh, it's, it's very sticky uh, from <laughs> Wrong way, do not come this way. Wrong way. <laughs> Wrong way. <laughs> You're gonna. So just wash your hands with it. And then for that, yes, keep your coin. You will use the coin this side. So just wash your hands with the river and just go to the other river and we'll be talking about. What do we need to do? We need to go fast. <laughs> so you just go straight and wait for me. Right here. Then you wait for me there. I'm, I'm, I'll be with you. Just wash your hands in here, and after that, I can wash it. It's almost all the way around. 
you don't put your feet in, you can put your hands, something to do, just, yeah, something to do, you like to work the trees or whatever. Um, some people like to have like, just a, a five time for meditation. Yeah, just go ahead. And the whole something to do. wanted to tell you, you've already seen it in the river, you've already seen some sparks, some sparklings and sparks, some golden this thing in the river, you've already seen it with your own eye. I told you this community have a lot of riches, but they don't want to risk that riches for their spirituality. So a curse has been placed on this land so nobody minds from this river. This place is protected 24-7 by the people of this community. The Ashantis always say, whenever you say your wishes on gold, okay. you are royal and your wish will always come to pass. So this is where you have the opportunity to say your wish. How do you say your wish? You can stand in the river, you can touch the river, and after saying your wish, I don't want to know what you are wishing for. After saying your wish, you bring your point out with your right hand. Anywhere in the river, just do it through. And when you're done with that, you climb it, and you don't look back. So if you want to take pictures, then you take pictures first before you say your wish. Okay, so you can look back. Hmm? Can't look back. Okay. Once you throw that coin, you got it here. Okay. Yes, one brother, yes. 